Ambitious and motivated are words that describe you best. Then you're on the right place. This is Motivational Radio Friends from Paris with your host, Longi Agoha. So, ladies and gentlemen, welcome today. And uh, I am privileged to be speaking to Martin Bukenya, who is a Ugandan. He is a speaker that is coach, leadership speaker, and he's going to talk to us today about leadership and purpose. Am I right? Good. So what is leadership and how can you define it? Well, I had a great definition from a certain man of God. He said that leadership is the capacity to influence others through inspiration, motivated by a passion, generated by a vision, produced by a conviction and ignited by a purpose. So what, what I believe that leadership is that a leader is born when purpose is discovered. Every leader needs to know their purpose. And in order to know your purpose, you need to, you need to have a vision. A vision is when you see your purpose in picture form. Leadership is truly, you have, you have to have an influence on people. And you have to inspire them, you have to motivate them. You have to have a passion that will drive them to do what you want them to do. So I believe that's what leadership really is, the capacity, the capacity to influence others through inspiration. Okay, so you have to be inspired to be a leader. Yeah, yeah you have to inspire. You, you have to be first inspired for you to inspire others. Okay, so you need to... Right, you, you said you need to define your purpose. You need to identify your purpose to be a leader, right? Yeah. Now, how do you how do you find that your purpose? How did you find your own purpose? To be honest, I, I had some visions of me doing some things, like leading people. Mm-hmm. So basically, I saw my my purpose in picture form. But not only that, you know, you know, and a seed like an orange seed. Yeah. Inside the orange seed is an orange tree. Right. So the purpose of the orange seed is inside of itself. So our, our purpose, our future is not ahead of us. It's trapped on the inside of us. So for you to discover your purpose, you need to be like a seed. You need to plant yourself in the right environment. And once you do that, you, you need to water yourself. You need to listen to the right information. When you, when, because the information you listen to will determine whether you grow or you'll be destroyed. So when you listen to the right information, you begin to see visions. You begin to see your true potential, your true abilities your untapped power. And the other thing is that you have to be in the right environment. And also, you need to have a mentor. So when you get these things together, you begin to discover your true abilities, your potential, the things that you've never done before. That's the real you. Because your your leadership ability is trapped on the inside of you. Your purpose is trapped on the inside of you. So that's how I found mine. Uh, I started going to the right environment, reading the right books, and also, because I'm a Christian, so I attend church. So the man of God, as he preaches, he's watering me. And then I begin to discover who I'm really are. Uh, and then God starts showing me visions of who I was born to be. Okay. Yes. That, that's wonderful you discovered who you are. Because I always tell people there are two important days in a man's life. The day he was born and the day he discovers yes. why. So you have discovered why you were born. Yes, indeed. You know, you know the, the, the greatest tragedy in life is, is not life. But life without a purpose. It's more tragic to be alive and not know why than to be dead and not know life. A lot of people wake up on Monday mornings, getting stuck in the same traffic, going on the same train, on the same bus, in the same car, going to a place they don't like, working with people they can't put up with, and doing things that don't bring out their gift. And also even getting paid far less than their wealth. And then they go back home and turn on TV and watch news or sports or movies. And then they go back in the same traffic, working with people they can't put up with, getting paid far less than the wealth. So it's very important to discover your purpose. Because your purpose is where your leadership ability comes from. When you discover your purpose, you become a leader. That's, that's what I believe. Right. You, I, I guess you are very right. I guess you're very right. But w- one thing that is really very tragic in this world where we live in is the fact that le- leadership or purpose, especially purpose, is not taught in school. So you've got to discover it yourself. And if you don't have that right environment, like you're saying, and then the right person, I mean, those who would help you to really bring it out for you, it would be very difficult for anybody on the street to do that. Indeed. I know it's, it's difficult, but this is the thing. Now, for example, for a young person, yeah. the responsibility is not to the teachers to tell the child that you should discover your purpose. The responsibility is for the parents. But then, some, some children, they don't have parents. And then some parents don't, don't have that knowledge to tell the child that discover your purpose, pursue your dreams. 
So that's why speakers, motivational speakers and coaches, that's what they're there for. To help these to help these people in general who haven't discovered their purpose to motivate them. But if anyone is listening to the people that are listening, the best thing to do is that get yourself and listen to the right information. Information will build you up. Look at people who have succeeded, those people who have gone to the top. See what they have done, see the principles they have applied. And also listen to the right information and surround yourself with the right people. When you begin to do that, you begin to release your potential. Your potential will begin to be exposed and then you begin to see who you really are. This podcast was brought to you by the Motivational Radio France with your host, Lonjago and Barris.